Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. And today is Saturday, February the 5th. And to the, here in Connecticut, it's very cold today. It's 26 degrees, feels like six. That is the report from the, from the weather channel. Um, yeah, so today's video, I am going to be sharing you with you a small haul that I got from Walmart. If you haven't seen my Walmart video, I will put it up here, but it's the video before this one. And um, what I bought, uh, the yarns that I bought were all on clearance. So that's what I want to share with you so that you guys will go to your Walmart and check out their clearance at your, uh, the Walmart at your, you know, your Walmart where you live. And the beginning of the year is the best time of the year to go to the stores and look around because this is the time of the year they put March stuff down and check out every department, okay? So I bump into this clearance by mistake. So I, I hope everybody's doing well. I am doing okay. And I, I'm in victory. I have to say that. I'm in victory. Praise God. I woke up this morning and, and here I am. The Lord's giving me another day to live. And he's given us another beautiful day and why I can't complain okay so yes I am in victory praise God and um, I pray to God that everybody out there is doing well and um, keeping safe so I went to Walmart with my daughter and I was looking for um, an uh, item I needed that the girls couldn't fine last week when I sent them and so then you know I had my camera with me I brought my camera with me and lucky I did um, I just wanted to show you the beautiful yarns at Walmart um, yeah so I hope you enjoyed that video but um, I turned off the camera before I turned around the corner usually uh, at the end cap they would put the uh, red heart super saver um oh go yarn i to my surprise there were hardly any there they almost sold them all out but they had a few but they used to have a whole in cap full of them but anyways there was a box there and it was a box there i guess they got the box from um uh, lion brand and my store the box came it's a brown box very long box and it had yarn in it and I'm just gonna share it with you right now but before I share it with you I'm just gonna take a cup of drink of my cup of coffee that um, I need right now because it's cold outside guys I don't know what's up with this coffee I made today but um, it tastes like my the coffee my mom used to make for me no lie and this is not the coffee that she makes. I think it's um, it's the Dunkin' Donut coffee, but I think it's the creamer we're using, and it gives it that Spanish taste. I don't know what it is, but it tastes really good. Mm. Oh yeah, so these are one of the the um, cozy mugs that I'm using to keep my coffee warm. So let me start it right now. So. They had a box and it was from Lion Brand and it said Hometown Yarns. Now, I share with you guys in my other video, I made some um, headbands with this yarn for my family for Christmas. And I just love how, and that yarn I bought it at, at clearance too. It was If you haven't seen that video, go watch it. It's in um, my channel. But that was the purple one. I used the purple one in another color, the, the tan one. The brown one and the purple one to make headbands and I tell you stuff I love this yarn so all the the hometown that they had in that box I don't I don't know about the shelves it was just on that box was on clearance so I'm gonna share them with you today two dollars for each scheme so the lion brand yarns hometown and this is one of the colors I bought And I never bought these colors that I'm showing you now. I never bought it from hometown. So I'm excited to use these. So I love it. It has that chart there that tells you exactly how many balls you need to make those garments. 
and this is a five ounce ball 142 grams 81 yards uh bulky number six and 100 percent acrylic machine washable and dryable made in turkey and a recommending crochet hook is a nine millimeter hook and also for for uh, the knitting needles okay this color is called Houston cream so I bought this one I think I bought only one of this but I'm gonna keep looking and see because see what else I have and these are all the same yardage let me double check oh interesting they are not okay so this one is 81 yards the first one I showed you and this one is 64 yards the same recommending hooks and needles a bulky a super bulky number six acrylic machine washable and dryable okay this color is called Cascales corner okay so it's that nice tan color Okay, I don't know if you guys could see that. I hope you could. All right. So, what really caught my eye, what really caught my eye was this one. Okay, so let's see how many yardage. 81 yardage. So this this one is exactly as, as the cream. Kind of like, um, yeah, it's cream. The other one's like a tan. And so, yeah, this one's called Luciville Julep. So I'll show it to you right there. It is L U uh, J U L E P. I don't know if you guys can see that there. Okay, but look at that blue. It's like that beautiful, um, kind of green blue. It's it's almost like a, t it's almost like that teal, light, like a baby green. And it's almost like a baby green, but like a light blue I can't explain it but there you go isn't that pretty so I bought like five of these so I bought five of these and there's one that the band is loose <laughs> so I have the band it just came loose it was loose at Walmart but I took it with me anyways so I could tape it so yeah so these are all the blue the I would say like a mint green right there put those there let's take out the ones already there's another tan and another cream so I got two tans two creams of these okay two dollars each they all rang out two dollars now I was uh they only had one of these and I was so disappointed I was hoping to find another one I love this green it's like it has green and, and cream like it has like a light green a darker green and cream mixed together um so this one's a 64 yards as well it's 100 percent acrylic the same bulky number six a nine millimeter hook to crochet so that's this one and the name is Rosetta dojo i'll show you the name and that's the color and you guys can see that isn't that beautiful beautiful and they only have one but I find it that with with this yarn the purple one the 84 yardage the one that has 84 yards I was able to do two headbands and I still had a little bit left so I know I could make a hat with this especially if I'll use the the I'm gonna try it out I would do one hat crochet one hat knit with the with the loom for adults and this one um is the 64 yards and this one's called jacksonville taffy it has like um and it's the only one they had um it has like pink and then a shade a little shade of purple and then it has silver silver gray and then that other color i can't I don't know if it's like a very navy blue. It's right there. I'll show it to you guys. Isn't that beautiful? 
So one of these. So go check out your, your Joanne. I know home. they've been putting the hometown on clearance. I, this is like the third time I've caught them on clearance for hometown. And I'm hoping they put the other yarns on clearance because in my store, I've just been um, seeing hometown. So um, I don't know why because um, this yarn is soft. I love it. Um, you know, this one is not as soft as the solid one. And let me see. And this one's very soft. But this one, for some reason, it's not rough, but it's not as soft as that. But I just, I just love the colors. And for $2, you know, you can make two headbands. Or you can make a, a hat and, you know, give them away. Homeless. Give them out to the homeless. Um, you know, you could sell them. So, I know I, know I wasn't going to buy any more yarn. I know I wasn't. guys get like me right <laughs> but someone gave me um these yarns came out to the money that someone gave me $29 and I bought spend that in, in the with oh for the yarns so I, I couldn't pass it was just two dollars I couldn't pass it so yeah and the reason I bought these these the, the yarns is because um I am Anyway, I'll tell you at the end. So, then, because I sent my daughters last week to, I'm making more of these cozy uh, rug mugs and cozy mugs, but I ran out of the buttons. So, I sent my daughter, and she said she couldn't find it. So, I went I went um, yesterday, and I mean, I, they had quite a few of them, and I found the buttons I needed. So, this is a jar for 10 Dollars. I, I like the mason jars. It's not like a mason. It's plastic. But I love the... It's not glass like mason's jars. But it's shaped like it. And then I like the button. Little cute design they have there. A button. I think I'm going to keep this. <laughs> to store other stuff once I finish. Maybe to keep storing uh, buttons once I finish. But this has multi sizes. Um, okay. So... I'm not sure what this is doing in here. All right, so I'll show you some of them, but you see the the very large button size, okay? It doesn't have here a list of the sizes of the yarn of the buttons, okay? So I couldn't tell you. I could tell you by looking at them. And they're different shades of wood. Some are lighter than others, and some are darker. Look at this interesting one, and it comes in different styles different shapes too because this is more this is more like curvy you see that almost looks like a bow all right and look at this one interesting this is supposed to be a button <laughs> there you go i think this is supposed to be <sighs> peace sign but i heard that this wasn't really a peace sign but We'll discuss that one day. And then this is another one. And another size. And this is another size. So this is the size I needed for my mug, uh, cozy mugs. This is the perfect size. Uh, you could use a large, but I, I, it's not necessary. You could use, save your large for when you make your cardigans and stuff like that. But I thought that was cute, $10. I wish it was cheaper, but I'm going to keep my eyes on them when they, get on, they go on sale. Okay. So, another thing I bought was, because I'm making, I show you this, that I bought the other one. This is my second one from Peaches and Creams Original. $7.50 for 14 ounce. Now, this is cheaper than what I found online. I checked a few websites, and this is cheaper for 14 ounce. 400 grams, um, and 674 yards for $7.50 for 100% cotton. This color is, I don't even know if it tells me the color here. You know, they don't make it easy for you. They just, um, these prints are very tiny. Happy Go Lucky. I don't know if that's it, but that's what it says there. And, um, so it's made in Canada, 100% cotton. This is a medium weight four. 
it's it's a very light four um for crochet hooks recommendation is a five millimeter hook knitting needles is 4.5 and i love it i'm making more um of the cozy mugs also and rugs with this but also washcloth dishcloth and um kitchen towels so i want to see how far the green one i still have so much left and i made already um so many of the uh cozy mug and the matching uh rug mug i think i made so many already and i, I still have so much left and I, I probably made like seven pairs or something like that but i still have so much left to make more kitchen towels kitchen towels watch towels uh washcloths so that's going it's going to be why I'm, I'm going to be using this for this is what i'm using this for look at the beautiful colors so it has the uh and i wanted another one it had a nice orange different color orange one but couldn't buy it so then anyways there's the the gold kind of yellow blue there's green in there there's of course the main color is white and i just love it this is gonna look cute because now for the springtime okay and then i bought a measuring tape because you know i'm gonna start doing tutorials and stuff and um my measuring tape like you know for fabric it's not here i was using a house measuring tape and you know it's plastic it bends it doesn't really go nicely and flat on you like this so this was a dollar at walmart okay so the reason i bought this stuff is that i am i am preparing myself this is for business so um i bought i'm, I'm making a list of items that I want to crochet and for the very first time I am going to be doing a uh, I'm going to be doing be selling my items at an, a, a market craft show and it's free it's free and I was so happy um so I had already sent her an email and everything so I'm waiting for her to get back to me but my daughter she makes candles and then she contacted her through email and then she sent her the reg registration form already so my daughter decided not to do it so i'm gonna do it and so i'm gonna be making bought these items to be making um crochet items of you know the dish you know the dish cloth wash cloth all the coffee mugs cozy mugs, and, and, and a bunch of other stuff that when i do have all that ready i will show it to you once it's already made but that's why you know you have to spend money to make money but it's going to all come back to me and especially if you could get the yarn for two dollars i mean that's awesome so that is my little haul for now <laughs> and um i'll show you a little clip of all the yarn at the end now um one important thing i want to talk to you guys about you remember that uh, they said that um, in every state, the government is going to be giving away free mask and the, you know, COVID testing uh, kits. So um, I've been waiting and waiting for weeks because they said that weeks ago. But finally, we went to the grocery uh, We went to our Rite Aid pharmacy store here where I live. And they had a table out full of these um, and all of these um, masks that they gave us. And this is the one that they gave us. Uh, it's the N95 mask from 3M. So it was three per person. And so this is it right here. And it's the one with two elastics that go over your head. One goes here, one here, which is perfect because it gives you a better fitting. And it doesn't come off your ear because it's around your head. Um, so this is how it looks in the back, the instructions and everything. That they s so I got mine, um, my three. And then um, 
I was happy about that because I thought I missed out because everybody else was saying that they got their mask, they got their mask and all this other stuff. But I'm like, where? We mean, we didn't got, we didn't, they didn't give us any notice as to where to go. But anyways, we got them. And so I'm letting you know to check out your town, check out the pharmacies and see who they're, uh, even Walmart's pharmacy, check them out. All your pharmacies, ask your doctor about it. They might know where you should go get it. Um, if there's a senior center near you, like there was one in, in, or uh, a town's hall, you might want to check it out with them. Um, or check out the website from your town. They might have a listing there where you can find your mask. But they're, they are already started to give them out. So I am so happy. And I just have to learn how to take care of them, wash them, and all that other stuff. Jazz. I mean, it's for free. You, you, you know, it's free. Why not? And these are not easy to find, okay? And if you do find them, they're very expensive. But I just wanted to share that with you guys. I have not seen the COVID kit. Um, but I'm not interested in that. So um, I have different feelings about that. Um, you know, so, I mean, it doesn't make sense. If you get like a sick and the symptoms are like you have a cold, then me, what we do is... Uh, my daughter gets tested, my grandson. I went and got tested recently with my daughter, and we came out negative. But um, to do it all the time, all the time, all the time, when they can't do nothing for you. So all they tell you to do is stay away from your family. Now so now it's five days. Now it's five days. It used to be ten days. Uh, you have to be ten days in, um, away from your family and your friends. And... You have to be in your room for 10 days or whatever room you want to be in. But then now is five days and you can even go to work after five days. So all I do is um, take care, make sure I don't get anybody else sick like I did when I used to have a cold. And um, that's it, you know. And um, if I'm really, really bad, then I'll go see my, uh, I'll go test it before I go see my doctor. But like I said, I don't know. They are selling out of these COVID kits in all pharmacy. You can't find them. So, where I live. Anyways, guys, so that's my video for today. And I just want to thank you guys for stopping by and taking out the time to watch my channel. I do appreciate that. I pray to the Lord for all of you. And um, I did, again, if you need prayer for any reason, just... You know put in the comments down below you don't have to tell me what it is if you want to tell me what it is that's fine because the lord knows or if you want to email it to me that's fine too my email will be down below i have one person who did comment down below in my first video when i did uh you know mention that i will be i was asking people if they they wanted me to pray for them please let me know one person then reached out she reached out and i just want you to let you know i hope everything's well with you i've been praying for you so and I have, and I will continue. Okay, so um, down below would be also um, one English, one Spanish with Christian music that I I enjoy, and hopefully you enjoy. Also, um, there'll be a Bible verse down below, and um, yeah. So, you know, um, I pray to the Lord for all of you guys to keep safe, and um, let's just um, do for others as others as you would like. For others to do for you and this would be a better world okay um yeah so you know let's pray for the family we're in february let's pray for the family that i'm pretty sure you have watching the news and heard the news all these um people dying and i'm talking about not COVID. <laughs> and i'm talking about crime i'm talking about suicide um mental illness people are suffering from let's pray for them they need our prayers okay may the lord keep you safe may he bless you and your family and um keep keep firm with the lord for those who are believers and are serving the lord don't quit you know no matter no matter what you see what you hear what's going on in this world take out time for the lord it is time for us to do this okay it is time to get in the fire with the Lord okay it's time to put our full armor of God on okay and um he's the only one that can help us through this all right but remember no matter what you're going through 
I don't know what you're going through, but God knows. Because I know I'm going through my stuff. But what helps me get through the day is that my Savior is with me every day and does not leave me. He's with you every day. He does not leave you. Even if you, you're like, oh, I don't feel you anymore. Oh, I don't hear from you. Just remember. Don't lose your faith. Remember, He is there with you. Just keep praying. Keep fighting. Keep praying and praying and praying and fighting. Okay, you will hear from Him. All right, and and he is hearing your prayers. All right, guys. So that's my videos for today. So I hope you liked it. Give it a thumbs up, and share it, and um, like this video. And I will see you in my next video. God bless. Take care. I'll see you in my next one, if God willing. Amen.